one is Eden and clearly I went a bit crazy on Amazon. It's almost all yoga props because I'm training in yin. I need props. I'll show you what I got, show you how it's used, or tell you how it's used rather. And I also ordered my Dia & Co Active Box, but it's not here yet. It's out for delivery, so hopefully it gets here sometime around filming. I did just recently change my style profile to be from like high impact, all that kind of stuff to yoga pants and things like that. So I'm excited to see what my stylist has for me. But I did pick up a few random things that weren't on Amazon. And the first two are these new vitamins. They look like this. So one is elderberry, one is turmeric. The elderberry has um, echinacea, which I love. I've been taking for over, gosh, at this point, over like 11 years, I've been taking an echinacea for like cold and flu season. Elderberry, zinc, which I love for cold and flu as well, and vitamin C. And then the turmeric one has fermented turmeric and ginger. So I'm super excited for both of these. This one tastes like apple cider. It's amazing for inflammation. I take them every single day because I do have some inflammation in my joints. I do have arthritis in my hip. So I take turmeric as a daily supplement. But having it as a gummy is so much more fun so yes for gummies I actually got two of these because they were $35 regularly $34.99 and then they were on sale for $25 so I got two of these and then one of the elderberry let's get into the big boxes this first box from the top people is um it looks like a bolster yes a bolster a bolster so this is a round bolster i got a round bolster and i also got a rectangular bolster because they serve different purposes or can serve different purposes so i want it to have both this one is a little bit bigger than i thought it was going to be it is from the brand um bean products yoga it's one of the higher rated yoga products can you see that there we go. So that's what it looks like. I love that it has the little handle on it. And yeah, super excited for this guy. Um, you can use this in yin poses to put under the knee if you have lower back pain and you need to lift your um, legs up even during Shavasana, you can use it. You can use it for things like frog pose, even things like child pose if you need a little bit of space between you and the floor. So first thing, a bolster. <laughs> box number two let's see what's in here i know what i got but i don't know what's in these boxes some of nicole's pills because she has to take little pills every day and i don't know what's in this box there's another box inside of the box so let's open this one up and see what it is Ooh, i'm so excited this is my yoga wheel so this is amazing for heart openers and good for practicing things like back bends. I got the cork one, so it's super soft on the outside. Hopefully it doesn't tear up too easily. But and then the inside is this beautiful wood look. Um, the thing with yoga wheels, um, a lot of them are only load tested up to 250 pounds, which is hard if you're a bigger person. Hi, Nicole. Um, trying to practice yoga. So I picked out this yoga wheel because it is load tested up to 500 pounds. So you can be my size, a little bit bigger, um, a lot of bit bigger, actually like double almost, um, and still be able to practice heart openers with this, different kinds of balance with this. This is from the Body Good Company. I have to hide my face in order for it to focus. <laughs> so yeah, super excited for this. I want to get into um, doing back bends from the ground up. I'm very good at doing back bends from the ground down. <laughs> so this is kind of a tool to help me with that and help me get further into different kind of heart opening poses. So yeah, very good for back flexibility amongst some other things. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for that. <laughs> So excited for my yoga wheel. I've been waiting to open this stuff for all of the boxes to get here and I just couldn't wait any longer. I was like, I'm gonna wait for my DA and Co so I can show my new, new yoga clothes too. And I'm like, I just can't wait. Box number three, smiley box number three. Ooh, they're so pretty. <laughs> so I 
got a couple of yoga blankets which can be used as props as well so if you're in something like frog pose where you're working on hip opening and flexibility um, and it's too much pressure on your knees you can use a yoga blanket like this to put under your knees to add some extra cushion because yoga mats can be pretty thin so I got two of these you can use them if you're in Shavasana and you want to cover yourself up um, to get into more relaxation during either Shavasana or like um, a restorative class uses blankets a lot so I got two blankets I got them in the pink color and I really really love them they are I wanted to see if it had the brand name on it but it doesn't there are so many boxes right now Nicole is gonna think those blankets are for her only her pills are for her last box but I still have more stuff behind the boxes so this must be my rectangular bolster oh yeah okay. so here is my rectangular bolster it's a little I don't know maybe a little bit shorter than I was expecting but not bad has a really ooh yeah really good density I couldn't get a bolster that was too firm because my big booty will squish it down. No, I think this is about the size of my other bolsters. Maybe just a tad bit short, like this much. But yeah, it matches my other bolster and I really love it. So, and that's all for yin yoga as well. And also just for like if you want to be elevated a little bit in a seat during meditation, um, that's good to kind of lift your hips up some so I have a few more things these are just a couple random things I got from Elqui a pair of leather jeggings I'll insert um, a photo from Instagram here and a really pretty tie waist sweater I did want to mention these because they have a discount thing going on if you use the code it's fall you'll get 50% off of one item and then 40% off of everything else which is a pretty good deal so I was putting this stuff away and I totally forgot to show you guys this beautiful vegan leather fanny pack from Eloquy and you can use the same deal for the 50% off of it and it's so big on the inside like super nice size it might not look like it on camera but it is an oversized fanny pack and it can fit up to a 60 inch waist so if you are a bigger girl it will fit you and I freaking love it and this isn't even all the way extended so this amazing can't wait to wear it i'm waiting to take pictures in it before i wear it which is like torture and then i also picked got my return i didn't pick this up from um universal standard so this is my geneva dress i went down from a size large to a size medium and i went for a petite instead of the regular because i'm right on the cusp of needing petite so it's a little bit shorter than the old geneva and i'm super excited to wear this i'm going to take pictures in this with the fanny pack so stay tuned coming to instagram follow me it is PETA vegan approved and cruelty free and all of that good stuff but yeah um i wanted to mention that not sponsored or anything i just wanted you guys to know they have a a deal i also got a new mat this is from lulu i don't really love Lulu because obviously I can't fit anything there but their mats are some of the best I used to have a Manduka sticky mat which I liked but it felt like it was getting eaten from the bottom the bottom was like getting super worn in and then I have one from Gaiam that I like um and a couple of other that others that I've tried but the Lulu ones are really really good they're expensive but they're good this is the reversible five millimeter mat and this one has just like lulu lemon written across the bottom but it's just like half of the words i prefer the five millimeter mat over the three millimeter mat just because i'm a little bit heavier i just feel like they last a little bit longer for me so this is what it looks like i don't want to roll it out because i'm sure you already know what a yoga mat looks like but this one is from lulu if you are a teacher and you didn't know you get 20 or 25% off if you go and register with them. So 
just know that for the future if you're a teacher and the last thing I got, the last thing I got were two yoga blocks. I picked these up from Dick's Sporting Goods. These are the Manduka um, cork blocks. I prefer the cork over the bamboo because they're just a little bit comfier on the butt. And the foam, they're good, but if you're heavier, they do kind of decompose a little bit over time. So I like the cork. They can get a little bit of a little bit imperfect because they're cork so it can chip off and things but if you want to sit in these like to modify yogi squat and things like that it's just a little bit more comfy on the bum because it has a bit of give so love these they're good if you are having trouble getting getting into down dog um and you don't want to bend your knees which you can bend your knees and down dog or for people that have like shorter arms than they do legs so that they can get the full posture so i love blocks there's so many uses for them they're amazing so i got a set of blocks as well these aren't all of my yoga accessories i do have some yoga straps and things but i didn't buy them just now this is stuff that I just bought I also got a couple things sent over from Vanity Planet I guess I'll show you guys that stuff too this first little thing is called a groove it's a head and scalp massager it vibrates which feels really good but I got it because a lot of people in the reviews said that they could wash their braids with it and now that I've been practicing a lot more I have had to wash my braids a lot more often because of all the sweat in my head and I don't want to do it with my fingers and get it all frizzy this is like a silk silicone thing you can kind of scrub get your scalp really clean and um sorry there's a hair stuck to my lip and all over my face okay <laughs> so you can scrub without you know messing up your style and same thing if you have like a weave and you need to wash it and you can't get your fingers in between your wefts you can put that in and it kind of just scrubs it for you and then you can just let the hot water one run through i'm still reviewing this when i'm done reviewing it i might do a sponsorship on it so if you want it now you can buy it if you want to wait <laughs> a little bit so that i can work in a discount for you then i'd probably wait but it says it can um Promote hair growth and scalp health, equipped with two speeds to fit your comfort needs. <laughs> Vibrations offer a relaxing massage, works to clean braids, weaves, and extensions, um, pairs with your favorite shampoo and conditioner or co-wash. So that's a really cool thing that I'd never thought of. <laughs> and I also got this big boy sent to me. It is called the Gleam Dual Sided LED Magnifying Mirror. I got this because my mirror, the front part is fine, but I broke the back side. So I've cut my fingers twice, moving it around the apartment. And lately, I've been trying to keep my makeup away from my window because I've been melting some of my stuff. I know. One of my lipsticks, I was like, oh, this lipstick feels really soft. It's because the sun got to it. So I've been trying to do it at my desk and there's no lighting over there. So I got this because it's I can move it around and it has batteries so I don't have to worry about plugging it in and then I can have light over there and it has warm warm light, cool light and neutral light. So you can kind of see what you'd look like in any lighting. So I'm going to review this too. If I like it, it will be in a video. If I don't, it won't. I actually get a lot more stuff from Vanity Planet than I actually ever put in videos because some of the stuff I just don't feel like is for me, so I don't actually do a sponsorship on it. So I test this stuff out first. So those are some things I'm testing. I also got a package from Rub Dolls, but I think I'm going to do a separate try on for this because this video is already long. My Dia & Co box finally got here, so if you don't know much about Dia & Co or styling boxes, you pay $20 for a stylist to pick out clothes for you that you usually wouldn't be able to find and also so that you can try them on in the comfort of your own home. You fill out a style profile and they charge you a $20 styling fee to send you your stuff. That $20 is taken out of any item that you choose to keep. If you keep everything in the box, you get 25% off. I feel like I've told you guys so many times and let's just see what I got this time. I did change my style profile so hopefully it's some good stuff I am an affiliate with Dia but as you guys know I'm super honest with them we've had some blowouts me and my stylist were not on the same page for quite a while um, my first two boxes were like 
total downsies. My third box, things started looking up. I kept almost everything in the box, so I have really high hopes for this box. And, oh, sorry. It also comes with the pre-paid shipping label, so anything that you don't like, you just put in the label, you're not put in the uh, mailer, and you're not charged for it at all. But, ooh, I see some pink. Let's get into this and see what Ooh, I see some floral too. What I got this time. And I feel like it's a sports bra and I specifically said I do not want any more sports bras, but we'll see. Let's just, maybe it's a tank top. Let's see. First item, a sports bra. <laughs> I don't know, I, did, I know I did not ask for sports bras, but this sports bra is really cute and I'll like the way it'll look poking out of tank tops. So let's give this a try. It's from Livy Active, which is Lane Bryant, which I could pick up in store. So I wish I was getting more brands that weren't available in store. And this is a size 24. So this one says gym and tonic. And it's just a long sleeve kind of Henley top. And it's cute. It has a little bit of braiding detail down the side. Again, from Lane Bryant something I could pick up in store, but it is very cute. I love message teas. I don't drink <laughs> except for kombucha, so it's kind of like a weird play on words for me personally, since I'm kind of straight edge, but it's cute. Okay, I did ask for more of this brand, so I'm glad that my stylist listened to that. This is 11 by Venus Williams, um, and this is just a little hooded top. It does have a pocket, I hate, hoodie is without some kind of pocket. So it has a pocket, long sleeve, does it have thumb holes? Yes, it has thumb holes. Your girl loves a thumb hole. Um, <laughs> I don't really like the gray. I get that it's reflective for like working out at night. Um, I don't really like the contrast of it, but it's so minimal that the pink is definitely the statement. So this is another top and it's 11 by Venus Williams as well and it kind of flares out at the back. We'll see once it goes on my body if it still does that because I'm wide, so it might not. And it just has a little cutout right here. My stylist knows that I hate cropped pants. I only like full leggings, but <laughs> she sent cropped pants and it's sports bra again. So these are 11 by Venus Williams. Um, they're cropped pants. I don't mind a cropped pant. Um, when I'm in yoga, but I don't like the way that crop leggings look when you're wearing tennis shoes Something about it's just a personal thing I don't like the look of crop leggings then you have your sock and then you have your tennis shoe I just don't like it. <laughs> I feel like they look fine in class. They look perfectly fine in class There's nothing wrong with them fun functionally. They're great for the summer, but um, Unless you're wearing a flip-flop <laughs> with them. I don't really like the look of them I think it just cuts at a weird place because I'm 5'4 so they're never not like correct crop length it's just it's a whole thing so these are 11 by venus williams they have a pocket in the side they feel nice and thick and um hopefully they fit so let's try this stuff on really quick okay so this sports bra is amazing and even though i asked for no more sports bras i'm really glad that i got it because it looks really great on me it holds the girls up really really well um i don't need to really worry like if i were running this would be an absolute no um way too much bounce but since i'm not running i'm doing yoga i can go into a down dog back up nothing fall out and it just looks really cute and then i also have on the pants from venus let me angle you down a little bit more so here are the pants they have a pocket on this side and on this side, which I think is really handy. You can definitely see the VBL, which I'm fine with that. And um, yeah, they're very good fitting pants. They're not too much compression, which is something that I asked for, um, a little bit looser of a pant. And you see what I mean with a crop? It's so long on me. It's not like, they're almost like 7 8 on me. But anyhow, I think this is a very cute outfit all together. Oh yeah, that's cute. 
how the bra sticks out just a little teensy weensy bit I love this and has a nice pocket this feels so nice fingers super good feeling quality oh I didn't do the bin test for the pants to see if you could see my butt through can you see my butt through I have on a ring light so if you're gonna see it you're definitely gonna see it <laughs> um, but yeah this is a really cute little hoodie it's a little bit loosey-goosey down here which I kind of like and a nice big pocket thumb holes everything I like so gym and tonic this is a cute top let's look I like that it fits really nicely I love the little side the little vents on the side that's nice just plain in the back super comfy nice going into fall yeah I like that cute too like she listened on everything except for me not wanting sports bras and me not wanting crops but I also feel like she's getting to know my style a little bit because even though they're not things I asked for I really love them <laughs> so this is the 11 by Venus um, tank top Ooh, it's, it actually fits flowy on me which is very rare for a 3x most 3x's are fitted on me so this one's a little flowy which is perfect and this is what it looks like up close the color and then in the back in the back just a little loose and it has that fun little vent if you can see it so for the first time in dia and co history i'm keeping everything in my box and um that's the beauty of like trying things on at first i wasn't super ecstatic about everything that i got but once i tried it on i was like okay these fit really well i like them even though they're not colors i love i can see them rotating into my life um so yeah i really like it i think my stylist did a pretty good job and things are really looking up for dia and co and that's just like trusting the process type of thing it takes your stylist a while to get to know you and sometimes she sends things like then i'm like oh no but then i try it on and i'm like okay yeah i really like this so um yeah the sports bra is everything and i know um i have probably a few sports bras that need to go because they're too small or whatever it is so this will be a, a nice one to rotate in especially since it's nice and long the way i like it but good job dn co i'll put a link down below if any of you guys want to check them out um they sell up to size 30 i believe 28 or 30 which is nice for us plus girls i hope you guys enjoy this ridiculously long haul until next time remember to keep an open mind keep an open heart practice unconditional compassion but don't take shit from anyone i love you guys endlessly and i hope you love yourselves even more i'll talk to you really soon <laughs> Bye.